All right, the next phase will be part of the concrete box, the sand battery box finally getting built. I'm gonna put some rebar in here, a little rebar here maybe. So I made this little map diagram of the box and these uh, concrete form parts I need to make. I had some forms that couldn't get loose on the very bottom. I mean, I could have got them loose eventually. I left them in, so I've come up with this three-piece three form idea. There's one made already. Can't even see the same, but that's actually three pieces. Oh, that should pop out easier. I'm going to do the same with the big, the larger forms on the inside too. These are interior forms that I can't seem to get broke loose very easily. So this should help. I think this will do it. These pieces aren't even screwed in, but they're so such a tight fit that I don't think I even need to worry about screwing them in. <laughs> Man, this thing works fantastic. I got it for like eight bucks at the Goodwill. If you get your, get a chance to pick one of these up, I would do it. I have the old corded same exact jigsaw. I paid like two hundred dollars for the Bosch corded uh, version of this exact same jigsaw, and I got this one for eight bucks. Can you believe that? So when I had these internal forms on the bottom when I first started this one set I couldn't get out now I have this new uh, theory here design three piece my theory is I'll be able to pull this T out and then everything will come out easily so I'm going to weld a piece of rebar here and weld my probably put three rebars hit here and uh, one little Maybe a couple L's connected all together all the way around. More materials. Got all the concrete for the next phase. And another batch of rebar. More rebar. I've got some work to do. I'm not sure if I'll get to this this weekend or Monday. But it won't be long. Monday or Tuesday she'll be finished up to this stage. At that point, I'll fill this in. Put the next uh, sheet on and then put the rods in. And then, uh, once I get those rods in place, I'll be able to continue up. I'll probably continue this wall up until I get to the base of these next hot air duct outlet here on these four outlets so i'll continue this wall up to meet up to the base of these outlet bricks in this trough i'm going to build i had purchased one of these about three months ago or more I can't remember exactly and it's uh the 240 volts 2,350 watts, 240 volts. So I went down and got three more today. 